All right guys, today we're gonna to talk about a little trick that's gonna help you beat someone that's got a good backhand cross court. Let's say you're playing someone and every time you get into a backhand cross court rally with them, you end up on the losing side of that. Uh, I hate to be sound sexist, but a lot of a lot of girls have some fantastic two-handed backhands cross court, and I know when I'm playing against them, I, I don't like that at all. So I'm trying to get out of that as quickly as I can. And the shot I use uh, is a little chipped backhand short into the court. So the ball comes, it lands deep, and instead of taking the two-handed back cross court, what I'm going to do is I'm going to chip it short into the court. So why would you do that? Well, what that's going to do is going to bring that person up and try and make them hit. A, a down the line approach shot. Uh, if they go back cross court, that's silly, because then I can go down the line. So a down the line approach shot is probably what they're gonna do. And what that's gonna give me is gonna give me a running forehand or a chance to pass them with my forehand, which is which is my favorite shot. And most people have a better forehand than backhand. So I'm gonna do that with Harry, uh, and we're gonna we're gonna show you, he's a lefty, but we'll just imagine he's a normal person with a righty uh, backhand. So here we go. As you can see guys, that tactic uh, is a little bit scary. Uh, if you leave that short one up high, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble. So make sure you can get that slice down low and short into the court, and then go ahead and hit that, that running forehand uh, cross court and pass them. Hope that helps. Uh, I'll see you next time, thanks. So I'm moving forwards, I'm hitting the split step. Go ahead, making the return, start the point. Uh, another thing, another side effect to this is if you can